I'm Cindy Cloward with Riley Blake Designs and today Lori's in the studio and we're talking about Cozy Christmas Fabric and her new vintage Christmas book. Welcome Lori. Thanks Cindy. And it's so exciting because you have so many projects made out of Cozy Christmas in your new book. But let's talk about um, the fabric. So we have a lot of original prints, but we have something new. We have a fat quarter panel. So tell me why we changed from a fat eighth panel to a fat quarter panel. Okay, so this was the original collection where there's eight different prints on three different colorways of the fat quarters. I mean, of the fat eights, excuse me. But we switched them to fat quarters. So in other words, we took four of the prints off of here and put them onto the bolt. Here's four of them. This is represents four of the different uh, 12 prints that we have now. We have them in three and different then, colorways. That's yeah. right, in three different colorways. And so the four prints that remained on the fat eighth panel is now a fat quarter panel in all three colors ways. So that so gives that you a little color. bit more fabric that way. And the reason that I wanted these on a bolt is because Vintage Christmas has a lot of projects and I wanted to be able to um, use these prints in like the borders, bindings, backings, all of that. So you just needed more fabric. You just needed more cozy Christmas because <laughs> yes, of this big did. book. <laughs> well, let's start talking about uh, the cover quilt. It's amazing and it has so many charming aspects from Christmas. So take us back to the quilt and tell us what's on there. Okay, so this is the quilt right here that's on the cover and it's all made with six inch blocks. And so if you have followed any of my books before, you know that I do six inch blocks and 12 inch blocks in the book. So this one is representative of the six inch blocks and it has the cute little bows in the corners. And it's charming, then, all those fun blocks. This block, here, let's move these fabrics over here. I'll move this out of the way. And then we can see that this one right here is 12 inch blocks. 12 so, inch, so it's the exact same blocks not there. Not all of them or else the quilt would like would be, cover this whole room. Yes, But ginormous. I took the picture blocks, mm -hmm. meaning, you know how I do like some traditional pieced blocks, mm -hmm. but then the picture blocks are all in 12 inch size in this Christmas Eve quilt, which is a queen size quilt. Oh, I love it. And you can just see the charm of them just a little bigger. So yeah. very cute. It's amazing how the blocks look different when yeah. they're tiny mm -hmm. into, into big. Let's set the book over there. Right there. So this is another one of the quilts. This, use, this is the toy soldier block. And Darling. this is the 12 inch size, two of them makes 12 inch. And I thought this would be so cute for a little boy. And yeah, very manageable yeah, to so make just, this quilt. You know, did yeah. my traditional gingham block that I mm -hmm. do in a lot of my projects and did toy soldiers all the way around. You notice the little buttons on there and of course, the, yes, they're the cute vin little buttons. vintage trim is in her binding, which That's I That's right, that. I use the vintage trim quite a bit. So there's the toy soldier, which is like maybe the boy version, even though, you know, girls like it too, but I had to do the dolly. Oh, cute. So this is the same exact setting of the quilt. I just switched out the blocks and then switched out the colors of the gingham. I love it. This is the first time I've seen all these quilts in person. So these are just- They're really fun. So fun. I can't wait to start decorating for Christmas. Yeah, I, I imagine. So there's 20 quilts total in the book. So this is just a few of them. This is the Christmas row quilt. Oh, look at the Christmas so trees. So this one Lovely. I've combined 12 inch and six inch blocks mm -hmm. together in one quilt. And of course, just a select few. But because they're all the same size in either six or 12 inch, you could customize this quilt and do whatever rows you want, whatever blocks in your rows that you want. And if you notice the background fabric this is not from Cozy Christmas, but it's one of the basics. Yes, that's right. like so basics. Lori Holt had designed this dot, um, and so you'll see that in a basics, and it's the aqua. So that's gonna be available all the time. That's the pin dot print, that's, that's pin called dot. pin dot. Okay, I really love this quilt. <laughs> so this one is bringing home the Christmas tree. 
uh, growing up in a large family, we had a station wagon, and that's what we tied the Christmas tree to. Because, uh, of course, yes, growing up on a farm, we had trucks as well, but we all wanted to go, so we all wanted to fit in the station wagon to pick out the tree, so we tied it on top of the station wagon. So. And I'm going to open the book to this page. Now, this page shows the quilt, but it also has your vintage little toy yeah. th that had the trees put on them. So my inspiration for collecting the vintage things are from my childhood, so... Uh, the photography takes place in my home, so I can use all of my little props and everything. Um, Kimberly and the girls from It's So Emma come over, and we have fun for a whole week setting things up. So That's so charming. Very fun. Okay, let's pull this. Oh, another row quilt. This is warm and cozy row quilt. It's just got the hats and then knitted scarves. Oh, cute. So this is like a big, long scarf. Yeah, this is one of the six-inch blocks that you put inside of it. See how you can see that's pieced here, so. Oh, I love that. So when you see the full <laughs> quilt, it's kind of hard to see it. Yeah. Hold it up like this, but when you see the full quilt, there's two scarves and then hats in a row in between. Well, you brought all your imagination and your memories to all well, these Christmas quilts. Well, Christmas is outside and, you know, <laughs> throwing snowballs and yeah. all that stuff. That's what my brothers and sisters and I did. So this one is Gingerbread Lane, and of course Gingerbread Houses, candy, candy canes, has to be included in a vintage Christmas book. So I love the candy prints. So fun. Yeah, they're fun. Oh, and you even have the little windows. Oh, that's, that's adorable. These are the little bells that are on the fat quarter panels. Mm -hmm. And, and the, the print that's in the border of this is an actual gingerbread cookie recipe for my grandma. So if you want to know how to make gingerbread cookies, you can actually follow this recipe. The directions are on here and the ingredients. And a great one to put with the gingerbread houses. That's perfect. So this last quilt is one of the Christmas memories. Quilts have two settings in this. You can see the gingerbread man one inside the quilt. I brought the snowman one to show you. And um, because I grew up on a farm, I use denim and dark colors a lot, mm -hmm. and I, I really needed to include it in my cozy Christmas. And I love how it makes all of the other bright vintage colors pop. And you've got some embroidery added, like the, oh, that's so cute. Of course, oh, you have that. to have buttons on a snowman, so. <laughs> yeah, we've got there, darling, very fun. So there's the snowman block. Then I've, di I've done um, several pillows. I think there's nine pillows in the book. So here is Little Deer block in 12 inch size. And this is the Snow Glow block. And it's got a six inch uh, fresh cut tree block inside with all the cute little buttons. Oh, so cute. No, now you can ornaments. see that Snow Glow. That's... And the vintage trims again. This is the large size vintage trim that comes in several colors. And we, I use it for the bindings. The half inch size is the perfect size to fit inside when you're binding. And that just adds so much charm. And so I also did some placemats and some mug mats. So oh, look at this. these are fun Santa. little placemats. The placemats <laughs> are done with 12-inch blocks. And just you can a use, place for your silverware. That's right. You can put your silverware in here. Over here, there's a little side place that you can put your napkins. These napkins are made from the fat quarter panels that are now fat quarters in the you know, 2018 Cozy Christmas. You think of everything. There's your napkins. And look at the gorgeous quilting on this. Yeah, isn't that oh, fun? My, my, my friend Julie Stubbs, she does my quilting and Absolutely. she does an awesome I, job. I love this. It makes it look like the beard. So, and it's got those little sparkles on this beard. I love that. That's one of my favorite prints from the collection. So here's the snowman block again, the 12 inch size. So there's another mat. So I did three samples for the book, but you can literally take any of the 12 inch blocks and make them into a mat, depending on how many place mats you need for your family. Oh, so much fun. You've got more. I do. We're not done. <laughs> not finished yet. What is this for? This, these are mug mats. 
So these are for your little snacks. So you can put your spoon in here and your cocoa oh and God. or a candy cane or whatever you want. So it's basically the same pattern as this only uh -huh. smaller shrunk down half the size because the block is half the size. So that is so cute. Like seriously, I want to come over to your house and just have hot cocoa. With one well, of these you, can, you can use these to put your cookies out for Santa too. So. Oh, very cute. And then I have um, four table runners in the book, but here's one that's represented. And this is the under the tree. And it's 12 inch and six inch blocks. Do you just change them out? Like you do, your I do. table and runners yeah. week to week? Mm -hmm. Oh, I thought you meant the blocks, but no. yes, I do change out the blocks <laughs> because they're 12 inch and six inch sizes. Yeah. So you can, no, I just you know, at your any... house, you have so many adorable Christmas table, table runners. runners. I put them all over. I you know, have a lot of tables in my home, but also they look really nice over the back of a chair, on your mantle, on your piano. Oh, darling. So, so there will be a sew along and there will be a link below and we will be making the cover quilt here in six inch blocks or whatever project your heart desires at a cozy Christmas. So get the book, get your cozy Christmas fabric and come sew along with us. And remember, today is a great day to sew with Cozy Christmas.